Okay, so we wanted to hang some solar lights on our um, <laughs> around our pool, and we didn't really have a good anything good to hang them from. And some of the brackets you get are really expensive. So we have this old um, pipe left over from our pool getting built. They just kind of left it in our yard. So rather than dispose of it, we decided to reuse it. We added two screws to the bottom to screw it into our wood posts that were pre-existing, and we have a hook here. It's one of the eye hooks. How, what are they called? Um, screw hooks um, that screws right in here. So these will get mounted right to the post and I'll show you the other one we have here. And as you can see, it is screwed in. Actually, where is the screw? It's screwed in right here. So you do want to pre-gel these holes in advance. And the nice thing about these particular lights is they have um, a little hole you can use to um, put your hook on through. So we're just adding these all along our fence line and I'll show you what it looks like. Okay, so we are going to just pre-drill the holes. In this case, we want to use our... This is a bad idea. You don't have to. Oh, I don't have to? You want me to push it? Pull it. Okay. So pre-drill the hole here with our drill press. Okay, so we got one, two, and we need one at the top as well for the screw. Go high. Wow, that's really nice. That is cool. Okay. This set has all of the light bulbs stored separately when you receive it. So you just need to go ahead and attach those, screw them into each of your um, brackets here. Okay, so we're working on getting a few more posts up and I've been screwing in all the bulbs. They're kind of plasticky and squishy. So I'm hoping that'll make them pretty durable. Um, hopefully they'll work good, all that good stuff. Hi Pepper. Okay, so now that we've hung it up, we can attach our solar panel here. And it just hooks in like this and it screws in. So you get a nice tight connection. Okay, so once you screw it in, there's a button on the back you can press to turn it on. Um, we're going to mount this to the wood first, um, just to get it up a little higher so it can get a decent amount of sun because we do want to get a good charge on this. Okay. So we're just attaching the bracket here to mount it to the wooden fence. Now that this is mounted to the fence, we're just going to reconnect it. This goes on like this. Okay, so that is that. It is connected. And we are gonna let it charge a little and we can show it to you once it is nighttime. Alrighty, there we go. Okay, so here it is on. There's actually a couple different settings here, it looks like, which I didn't realize. Uh, let's see. <laughs> the problem is the button is on the other side. So you can have it blink, which I think would be really annoying, but that's me. Um, obviously, just normal lights seem like the best option, in my opinion. Not that. Okay, I'm hoping it had enough time to charge. We'll stay on for a sec. Hold on, sorry. Let's get back a little bit. So there we go. I mean, it looks pretty good, you know? Trying not to fall in the pool. I really like the solar option, so I don't have to worry about having it plugged in. Um, 
it looks great and I think these will do the trick it keeps it nice and high so we can walk through the gate without getting bopped in the head and uh, yeah overall liking it think it'll be great so I may actually order another set so I can continue it down the side here but um not sure so alrighty I hope this was helpful thanks so much take care